Action News, Delaware Valley's leading news program. You guys are going to love this. This game is just one of the half million apps that you can download on your iPad or your iPhone. It's called Dare to be Square, the adventure of the red square. And check it out, guys. Look at this. There are 10 levels. The square has to fight enemies of many shapes and sizes. Let's get this thing going here. Basically, if I, if I move this square around, and apparently if you come in contact, all right, I'm already, I'm already out. But again, there are 10 levels if you can do it. It's all the work of one very smart and savvy seventh grader from Delaware. I will figure this out. So you have to account for that zero seven times. That's 12-year-old Rumi Khan taking notes in math class just like every other seventh grader at Newark Charter School. But crunch these numbers. There are currently more than 500,000 iPhone apps, and this tween has created one of them. It's a big deal, and I can count the kids who made an iPhone app only on one hand. How did you learn this technology? It took me a really long time actually. A few months of researching, just looking at tutorials on the web. Four months later, Dare to be Square, the Adventures of the Red Square was available in the App Store. That's the main character, mm -hmm. the square. Yep, this is, I'm trying out playing with abstract concepts. He designed the shapes, created the graphics, even wrote the code. This is a great use of the physics engine. Oh, and Rumi even founded his own company, Grabby Arm Games, and manages his own marketing. I released the app when it was 99 cents. Waited for a few weeks, then made it free, and I got 700 downloads. To be fair, he did need help with the I mean, music. Yeah, the and dad handles the finances. Occasionally we take time off to be proud of him, but the rest of the time we are working to manage him. In his spare time, Rumi writes more than just code. So this is your blog on astrophysics, and I have a video on how to make a radio. And he's also flushing out a business plan. My app's free, but I want to make some real money with this. <laughs> so this is your first app. Mm -hmm. Are the wheels spinning for number two? Mm, numbers two, three, and four. <laughs> <laughs> Watch out. I'm going to create like three app, free apps that are really high in the rankings and then boom, a paid one. <laughs> boom, and that's where the money comes in. Wow. Now, if only I could stay away from this vicious triangle and he says that the hexagon is the really annoying one. Can you I imagine? Mean, we are looking at potentially the next Steve Jobs here. Absolutely. Right? I said to him, you are like the Doogie Hauser of the technology world. And he said, I don't even know who that is. Oh, and then no. I said, no, I really feel old. <laughs> One thing he doesn't this. know. One thing Isn't this cool, by the way? Very cool. You figure that out. Yeah. We're going we're gonna to talk traffic. I won't be writing code. How about that? Thank you.